Welcome to this video presentation of the Vodacom Warehouse. This video will give you an overview of general safety in the warehouse, highlighting possible risks and hazards, and the measures you must take to help keep you and your coworkers safe. Let's first talk about our new operating model, Hub and Spoke Overview. The Hub and Spoke model enables us to consolidate our warehouses into much more simpler and leaner model, creating a lean, agile, responsive, cost-effective supply chain solution for capital projects and maintenance support. This model is underpinned by logistics control tower for integrated transport planning, optimization and execution. By creating a central point to manage capital project stock from, it allows for improved visibility, flexibility, cash flow and planning of capital project and spares. The business case benefits are derived from the consolidation of our warehouse's footprint, overhead costs and resourcing. The key drivers of cost in the current model is the number of and duplication of warehouses that is not economical to operate. The hub and spoke model will also allow the business to expand the transport milk runs to and from regions. Operating model is comprised of one main hub warehouse in Midrand for equipment, recoveries and spares. Equipment will be configured centrally and issued to regions based on project status. Six regional outsourced facilities for the staging of rollout equipment and storage of critical spares. A logistics control tower to optimize transport modes to and from regions based on demand with a predictable cadence. The benefits of our operating model result in reducing our storage locations by 67% from 33 storage locations to 11. Our warehouse footprint has been reduced by 36% from 36 kilometers to 23 square kilometers. Here are the ways our operating model has brought value. Improve working capital through inventory and supply chain optimization. Optimize spare parts stock holding and locale. Increase project rollout flexibility and responsiveness. Reduce stock or equipment redundancy. Improved equipment reutilization. Improved visibility and inventory control. Arriving at the warehouse. Important. The guards have been tasked to control entry and exit as well as to communicate the proper procedures during all visits. Please assist them to assist you. All visitors to drive directly to the designated parking destinations as directed. Strictly observe the speed limit of 20 km per hour at all times. Also, exercise caution whilst driving around any bends in the road. Drive directly to the parking in front of the stairs deck and attend to the warehouse reception. All employees are to use the entrance doors provided in accordance with current instructions at the time. Business Visitors Park in the designated area and proceed to reception to meet with your host. Follow the orange route as displayed here. Trucks to temporarily hold at the truck hold point and driver to attend to warehouse reception for directions. internal areas. From this top view, we can see the warehouse and all its various departments. From the racking, mobile handling equipment, kitting, offices, outbound and inbound, 
battery testing, sorting and screening and so on. In-house racking and flow overview. There are a total of 13,204 pallet locations. Here is a proposed standard rack layout in our warehouse. Brown represents a standard rack. The green represents the satellite rack. Blue is the marketing material rack and yellow is the aerial storage rack. PPE Guidelines PPE is the abbreviation for Personal Protective Equipment. The PPE requirements for the warehouse are Safety Boots Breathalyzing on site the risk presented in a Vodacom warehouse is of such nature that we need to mitigate the risk by conducting breathalyzer testing to ensure we provide a safe working environment for employees, consultants, independent contractors, subcontractors, suppliers, visitors and customers, safeguard our assets and protect our reputation. The use of drugs and alcohol is prohibited. Random alcohol and drug tests are done on a daily basis and supervisors can request that individuals go for testing as well. Here is a list of the equipment stored in our warehouse. HSE considerations on site traffic flow and traffic rules. Familiarize yourself with the flow of inbound and outbound areas. Safe walking areas. Watch where you are walking and only use designated walkways. When going up or coming down stairs, Always maintain three-point contact. This simply means that you must hold the handrail. Smoking area. Only smoke in the designated smoking area. Evacuation route. Emergency exits are located here. In case of fire, smoke and fire detectors will activate the alarms. Proceed to evacuate immediately. Check if you can assist a fellow employee. Call the control room 011-653-5034. Care for persons needing assistance. Proceed to this position and await further instructions. Mobile handling equipment. Moving machinery consists of various types of supplier and contractor's vehicles, delivering and collecting goods from the Vodacom DC. Examples include SUV, 2-36-ton truck tractor combination vehicles. It also comprises of forklifts, reach trucks, and platform low lifter trucks moving goods inside the Vodacom DC.
risky areas. The Vodacom DC performs testing and rebuilding of network equipment as well as battery recharging with added risk dimensions. Safety in the yard Unsafe conditions are things such as faults to machines, engines, pumps, vehicles, electrical apparatus and hand tools that could cause injury or damage and which in general could have been corrected. If you or your co-workers sees something that you think is a risk or hazard that has the potential to cause an injury or fatality, tell your supervisor immediately. Remember that you have the right to a healthy and safe work environment. All personnel that visit the warehouse need to be accompanied by a warehouse person unless properly inducted or authorized to execute work in the warehouse. They also need to adhere to the PPE requirements as the minimum safety requirements to enter the warehouse, signage and what it means. Be ever mindful of the safety and warning signs in the warehouse. They exist to keep you safe and to direct you to where you need to go. We will explain the meaning behind the following symbols here.